uh, I kind of got into a bunch of different e-commerce websites. So I would try different, like I would try selling different products or I would start uh, building websites for people and I just never really made any money. But I tried all these different online stuff. And then uh, I had broken my iPhone 6 and I was like, crap, like I didn't really have a whole lot of money so I didn't want to take it somewhere and it'd be really expensive to fix. So I looked up on eBay uh, the parts, I found them and ordered them. And then I watched a bunch of YouTube videos and figured out how to do it. And so uh, I just started taking apart my phone. It took me three hours. I did it on this tiny little uh, coffee table. And literally, there was parts covering the entire thing. It was, it was crazy. And, and the screws, if you've ever seen them, they're like itty-bitty. So uh, that was quite the experience. But uh, anyways, I get through about three hours. And then I'm, I'm all excited because I don't have any parts missing. I just have everything put together. So I turned it on, and I had lines running through the screen, and I was like, crap, and they weren't there before. So I was like, oh, gosh, what do I do? So uh, 15 minutes went by, I kind of flipped out and came back and realized I hadn't pushed the cables in hard enough, and it was fixed. I was like, oh, wow, this is awesome. Nice. So uh, I was kind of jumping up and down because I was like, finally, I fixed it. So it's like, well, maybe I could do this on the side. So I would, uh, I put some Facebook Marketplace listings out and said, like, I offered a phone repair service. And so people uh, messaged me and we'd set up a time to usually meet like in a public place, like a, like a gas station or something. And uh, I'd fix their phone in about 20 minutes, hand it back to them, and they'd be like super happy. But I kept hearing over and over from like so many people like, man, this is awesome. I really appreciate it. But man, this looks really sketchy, like a drug deal because they'd hand me a lot of cash and be like, thank you so much. So uh, everyone kept telling me, hey, you should start a store. So that was kind of on my mind a lot. Is like, man, maybe I should start a store. 